look, you don't need to be sold on the advantages of doing a swap from a carburetor to electronic fuel injection. You know that the systems on the market today are better than they've ever been. You know that you don't need a laptop or a ton of tuning experience to be successful. You know your car is going to start better, it's going to run better, and it's going to be more fun to drive after you do the swap. But something's holding you back. Now you may be the kind of gearhead who hates doing electrical work, and you're especially worried about having to find a separate ignition solution. One thing that's definitely on your mind is the price. Compared to anything but a really high-end racing carburetor, EFI is frankly pretty expensive. Well, we've come across a company called Fitech that's tackling those objections head-on with a lineup of EFI systems that offer a ton of value and a lot of high-end features at entry-level prices. We're here visiting their facility in Riverside, California to get the full details on their fuel injection products and take a look at some that they've installed on their cars. First up is the Go EFI 4 system. Now at under $1,000, this is a throttle body EFI system that will support naturally aspirated engines up to 600 horsepower. At that price, you may be wondering what features they left out, but the truth is that this has got a lot of stuff that more expensive systems don't even offer. Now it can operate with your existing ignition setup, or it can drive a coil directly because it's got built-in total ignition and timing control. It's also got a programmable fan control output. All of the electronics, with the exception of the handheld controller, the coolant temperature sensor, and the wideband oxygen sensor are all built into the throttle body, so there's no big harness to drape over your engine. And all of the sensors are OEM style, so they're reliable and they're easily replaceable. On the fuel side, the pressure regulator is built right in too. And if you decide to go with the optional fuel command center, you don't even need to run a return line. Now, if you do decide to use a return style fuel system, there's a built-in voltage control setup that will allow you to slow the pump down when the car's at idle to reduce noise and heat. Frankly, it's pretty amazing how much they've managed to pack in there, especially when you consider the $995 price tag. Now, for 90% of the people out there who are doing an EFI conversion, this is going to be all they ever need and more. Okay, let's say you're running forced induction. Blow through turbo, centrifugal supercharger, root style draw through blower. Fitech has you covered with their power adder version of the Go EFI 4 for just a little bit more money. It's still rated to support up to 600 horsepower and it'll work with up to 25 pounds of boost straight out of the box. Now for nitrous fans, it'll run a single stage wet kit with air fuel correction. And whether you're running boost or spray, it's got built in ignition retard capability. It's even got a built-in air conditioning kick-up function, a second channel of fan control, built-in data logging, and the ability to tune via laptop. The Go EFI 4 gets its name from the four fuel injectors that are built into the throttle body. So when you see the Go EFI 8, you can probably guess how many injectors it's got. Now doubling the number of injectors doubles the amount of horsepower it'll handle, but this top-of-the-line system from Fitech will happily run anything from 250 to 1200 horsepower. It's got all the same features as the Go EFI 4 Power Adder version, including the ability to handle up to 25 pounds of boost or run a single stage of wet nitrous. Now for just under $1,500, we haven't seen anything that has this much bang for the buck. The Go EFI 2x4 will handle up to 625 horsepower naturally aspirated engines. And because the throttle bodies are so compact, it's a direct bolt-on for most popular dual quad manifolds without requiring any spacers, turning the throttle body sideways, or goofy throttle linkages. The Go EFI 2x4 power adder system was designed specifically for 671 or 871 blowers, and it's good for up to 1,200 horsepower. No matter which Fitech system you're looking at, they all feature easy setup with a handheld controller and fast and accurate self-tuning. They all feature Fitech's unique wet flow annular discharge design as well, which improves fuel atomization and distribution for better performance and excellent cylinder-to-cylinder -cylinder consistency. Fitech built their business on being the 995 EFI guys, but it's clear to us that they've packed a lot of quality and a lot of technology into everything they make. Now, we've only scratched the surface here. For more